Good morning, Internet. This is Alex da Sudoku, and it is Monday, the 7th of September 2020. Hope you're ready for the week ahead. Um, let's dive into some New York Times Sudokus with Snyder notation to start with. So the two ones gives us a pair of ones, and I think that's it. So twos, and I got two twos. Can't see anything with that. Got a pair of threes over here. Um, nothing else on threes. What about fours? I have a pair of fours over there, a pair of fours over here. So I've got a one four pair forming already. There's another pair of fours over here because of these two fours, which locks a pair of fours over here. Um, I think that's it. So what about fives? Well, these two fives locks a pair of fives over here. And that's it. Sixes are locked over here because of these two sixes and that's six. And I've got a pair of sixes here thanks to that six and that six. So that locks a six in this position. Um, I've got another pair of sixes up here because of that six. The one four pair locking these two cells and a six over here. So therefore there's a six locked here because of these two sixes. And these two sixes actually locks a pair of sixes over here, so I can even resolve this six up there. So that's good. Um, I think six is all pencil marked in now. Let's move on to sevens. I've got a pair up here. And... That's it. What about eights? Um, I've got a pair of... Oh no. I've got a single eight locked at the bottom because of these three eights. And... Let's see, I have a pair of 8s there, thanks to this 8, and the 1-4 pair, so there's got to be a pair of 8s locked in here. Um, I also have a pair of 8s over here, actually, because of that 8 and that 8, so this 8 is resolvable. And I think that's all we can do, so moving on to 9s. Um... Nines, I have a pair of nines over here, thanks to this nine, that creates a nine four pair, which means I've got a pair of ones, pair of threes, and twos can be anywhere here. If twos can be anywhere on the top, then they have to be over here on this um, on this row. So let's finish off with nines as well. I've got a pair of pointed nines looking up and a 9 over here, that forces a 9 in here, which in turn forces a 9 over here. So, I think that's all I can do with the 9s. I uh, may have something on this row now. Let's see, also I have a pair of 3s because of the 4 in the corner within a cage it means anything that sees into the row or the column are locked in the opposite direction. Uh, I've got a quadruple here, which will be two, in fact, I've got a pair of twos over here because of these twos. And let's see, three can't go there. So three, seven, three, seven, five, three, two, two, three, seven, and five, two, three, two, seven, and five, two, three, seven, and five. I've got two and three, so that's five and seven. Mm, don't think I can deduce anything yet. What about in this cage? These are two, three. Oh, these are two, three, five, and seven as well. So that implies these two cells are the same. That's interesting. Um, so if these two cells are the same, then they have to be locked down here as well. But I can't deduce whether that's a two or seven either. So let's uh, move on from that for a sec. 1, 3, 5, and 2. 2 must be a weak number then. I'm seeing a lot of 2s. Let's see. 2, 2. 2's are locked over there. Let's just do a little quick round of notations. 1's. Uh, 1, 1. one. Huh. Um, threes. Let's see, I have a three locked up here because of the pointer pair of threes and this three over here. So that unlocks the three in this cage as well. 
and I've got a pair of threes locked over there because of that three and that three and finally I have a pair of threes down there okay fours four oh no there's a four over here so four four <sighs> You're only for a change rather than um, sneezing. Uh, fives. I've got a pair of fives up there because of the f single five and the pointer pair of fives. That means these are now twos and threes. Now, if that's the case, then twos can't go here. So that does imply. Yeah, if the two can't go in here, it can't go in there either, is that right? No, whatever is in here. Yeah, whatever is in here has to be in there as well. So I think I've just ruled out the two from that cell because the two can't go in here. I don't know if this makes sense because I've got a triple here and this triple belongs to the same... Um, th sorry, this quadruple, two, three, seven, two, three, five and seven matches um, what's on the roll, therefore this cell and that cell has to be the same. And I just ruled out a 2 from this cell, therefore 2 can't go in there either, so I think I've just resolved the 2 and 3. And that leaves me a 7 and 5 pair over here, and I've got a 7 and 5 pair up there, which means this has to be a 2 now. And that leaves me with 5, 8 and 7 at the bottom, which makes sense. Five, so, f oops, fives have to go there, so seven is here, leaving me with a pair of sevens over there, and nothing else. So that was an interesting bit of logic to eliminate the two, to um, remove the two from there. Um, let's see, uh, five, so, did we do fives earlier? I don't know if we did, so let's stick to fives for a second. Five, five, five. I think I have done fives. What about sixes? Have we done all the sixes? No. Uh, we've got two pairs of sixes, but we can't resolve them yet. What about sevens now? I've got seven locked over there. Over there. Ah, no. Got semi-excited for a second, but... That's not right. So, eights, 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 nines. So I've got a pair of nines over here because of the points a pair of nines and a single nine over here. So that creates a four nine pair, which means these are one, five, and two. So twos have to go there. Um, and one can go in all three cells. That's not useful for me at all. Uh, let's see, twos can go in any of these cells. So these are, oh, actually, these are ones and twos, aren't they? Um, but that doesn't help me either. So, anything else I can do with the nines? Let's see. Nine, 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 nine. No, not that I can see, so... Probably worth looking at the weak areas again. Um, but it doesn't feel like we have many weak areas. I've got two and three over there. One and two over here. So what about here? One, two, three and five. I've got two and three. So that's one and five. Um, there has to be two and three. That can be one, two and five. This can be one, two and three. So that's not very useful. No. Um, so we haven't got any triples. I think we'll have to go into the quadruples then. Um, okay, so. Let's see, these are two, four, one. Actually, let's look at a weak area, weak numbers first. So ones are still weak, twos aren't weak anymore. Threes, fours, fives. Ooh, fives are weak as well, actually. So one and five, seven, eight, nine, 
Okay, one and five. Let's see then. One and five. We've got a lot of um, pointed pairs, so that's worth noting. So let's look at these two cells. Uh, one, two, th one, two, three. Can't four, five, six, seven. Uh, I can't see eight or nine. That was so close. Um, and there's no way that can see eight or nine either. So anywhere else, I can see a one and five. One and five. That's exhausted. Um, five. No, I don't think we can get anything out of the ones and fives actually. That's disappointing. Um, no, can't see anything else. So I wonder if it's worth doing one more round of pencil marking because we did change this cage. So ones. Twos, two, 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 two. Ah, so twos actually locked in those cells. Threes. Oh, that three is eliminated. So that doesn't give me anything right now, though. So fours. Four. Four. Can't see anything else with four. So what about fives? Fives. Not that I can see. What about sixes? I've got the two pairs of sixes. Sevens. Seven. Can't see anything as sevens. Eights. Nines. Yeah, it feels like I'm not going to get anything out of this. Nines. So let's do... Since we placed the three, let's just double check it hasn't changed anything. So six, nine, three, two, six, three, four, three. No, I don't think that three has changed anything for us. Okay, so I guess we do need to look, explore the quadruple areas. Um, although, let's step back a little bit. See if we can spot anything. Okay, so we've got a triple here of one, two, and three. So I've got another triple of six, um, six, five, five, six, and seven. Okay, five, six, and seven. Mm. Nope, can't see anything of that. That's disappointing. So I've got two triples on that on that roll. Um, anything else? Do, do, do. Not that I can see. So I think we do need to tackle the quadruple areas now. So we have one, two, four, and one, two, four, and nine. One, two, four, and nine. Can't see anything. Um, I think we looked at this um, one, two, three, and five. We've got two, three there. So that's one, five, yeah. Um, that's a quadruple. One, four, let's see, one, four, five, and seven. One, four, five, and seven. Nope. Five seven one five seven one four five seven. We've got five seven there. So that's one four. That's one four as well. So this has to be a five seven because I can see the pointer pair of ones and a four. So this is five seven. Therefore these are one four. Um but I can't eliminate any of them. Damn. Can't eliminate anything else, can I? Can't eliminate the seven or the five here. Nope. Have I got another five seven over here? No. Those are the five sevens. One, two, four, and nine. 
Hold on, four and nine already there. Oh yeah, that's one and two, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, what about the rolls? No, we haven't got any quadruples. What the hell? What am I missing then? Let's look at this roll then. Okay, we couldn't find a naked digit from the one and five combined. Maybe we should look at just the five and see if we can find a one. Maybe that's what we should have done. Uh, two, three, can't see a four, so that's one and four. Oh, if that's one and four, hold on, two, three, um, five, six, can't see a seven either, so that's one, four, and seven. annoying. Oh no, you can't you can see a seven because of the point is seven, so that's a one four pair. Therefore this is a pair as well. So these are a pair of sevens and what are they? Sevens and sevens and fives. Which again we can't see any of. We've got lots of one four and seven fives, so I feel like I need to fill in the seven and fives. So that's one one four. These are seven five. I've got my seven five here. One four one four. So these are one four and six. That can't be one. That can't be four. So there we go. So that has to be a six. Therefore, this is a one four pair. I've got my one four one four. So is this a seven six? But before I do, I've got a one four pair pointing over here. So four and nine are resolved. And two and six are resolved as well because of the six up there. So, okay, now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. So one four. There must be a seven five in here as well. So, let's see. Seven. Seven and five can go there, but can other cells go there? No, because um, the other cell is eight. And we already see that. that no, hold on. I've got two numbers left. Um, eight and nine, so can a nine go in there? Um, yeah, it can go in there, so let's leave that for now. I've got a pair of ones over here because of that one. Um, okay, so that doesn't do anything, so what about five? Five, six, seven, five and seven seeds into that cell, so it feels like I've got another five, seven pair there, but five, seven, and nine, so nine, okay, nine has to go in the bottom, and so that implies there are no five, seven pairs, which is disappointing, um, okay, so this is not right, I've got one, two, four, and nine, so two, that's it, two and seven are resolved, so that two resolves the two and five over here, and... Does that do anything else? It locks a pair of twos, but it resolves the two and three over there, so that resolves the one, three, and two down here, which means that is now a three. Oh no, it's a one, which resolves the one, four, one, four, four, one. So those are resolved. Uh, five and seven, that, that is a five and seven after all. Um, but are there others? Um. Ah, if that's a 4 or 9, because it can't be a 5 or 7, this has to be 4 or 9, which means there has to be a 5 or 7, which means these are 8 and 9 then. Yeah, these are 8 and 9, that 4 resolves to 9 and 4, which means 8 and 9 are resolvable, which means 9 is down here, 4 is over here. And that leaves me with ones and well, one has to go there. It's one and eight, which means that's a five, that's an eight. And that means if that's a five, then five has to go down here. One, five, and nine resolvable. Seven goes there, so seven, 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 five, 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 and five. And that is today's hard New York Times Sudoku. Um, I probably did it in a silly way, but there does seem to be interesting logic over there. So I hope that's been useful. And um, please like and subscribe. Not that anyone is watching these at the moment. But um, it really helped me if um, more people watch my videos.
bye